Hello everyone, welcome back to the tent well. If you guys have been watching the series on this, we got the parts, dug the hole, installed the well, got it pumping fairly clear water now. What I'm going to do today is I want to put a cement slab around the bottom of this because since it's only you know, 12 feet down or so, when you, when you pump it, it moves a little bit and I kind of want to get some cement around there to hold it more solid. Plus, when the water comes out, it erodes the ground real bad. So we're just going to do a little slab, I don't know, a couple feet wide, maybe a little bit wider than that, a little bit there, just so the water comes out. It'll hold this more solid and just be a little bit of a cleaner area. Okay, now that I've got all this set here now, I've got it sloping this way and this way. Uh, you don't want it to be level or you're just going to puddle water in the wintertime, it's going to be a problem. Now I just have to go through, I run a board over the top and make sure I'm no more than three inches deep. I want it a little bit deeper right here to help kind of hold this. Uh, so we're just about ready to pour concrete. Well, now it's all poured and just got to let it set up for a while. There's really no need to do any troweling on this because I'm just going to broom it. I want it rough, otherwise it gets really slippery. So um, anyway, we just got to let it set up for a while and then broom her down and should be good. Okay, everyone. Well, there it is. Everything's done. Uh, I'm not going to pump on that well now for a couple days. It's sat most of today. I'm going to let it sit all of tomorrow and let that really cure good. Uh, the concrete is still, if you run your hands over it, it's still not completely hard. And it's supposed to rain tonight, so I'm going to tarp over the top of that and let that just dry nice and slow. So anyway, that part's done. Before I leave up here, I'm going to be taking a sample of the water, and next week we're going to test it.